this video is going to be a casual, chill, sensory play ASMR video. It is not a, a any like healing a specific healing video. It's more of a yeah, like a sensory play and chill and um, relaxation and kind of light um, light energy. Uh, yeah, so uh, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, I appreciate if you you know comment and uh, like, subscribe and you know put the alarm and everything. Everything that you know helps my channel i really appreciate it and just appreciate you stopping by and watching i hope you enjoy hi um we're gonna start by lighting a candle made this candle the other day. It's like a really simple one, not like anything fancy, but it's made uh, um, with soy wax, uh, like soy wax flakes. And sometimes I, I spend a lot of time and, you know, do like herbs and crystals and stuff in them, but I just wanted to start off the fall with a few simple ones. Um, So, I'm going to light that. I hope the wick, like the wick is like two years old. Um, I'm gonna hope that it works okay. Um, you know, I put some lemongrass essential oil in it. Let it light in the background. I just bought a bunch of these little jars. So cute. And I'm going to show you our smaller ones. Yeah, so there are these, and then there's like bigger ones that I've had for a while, and then this size, and then this like tiny, 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 they're so cute. 
I don't know yet what I'll put in this, but I just put something like that I had on hand, like some rose petals, tiny ones to burn, and chamom chamomile flower buds. mainly like a like a relaxing no talking video with uh, essential oils i i uh, brought up this this is the rose petals that are in the jar and some <coughs> someone commented that it was a really nice sound so i'm gonna just play with that now The reason I have this is, is that um, I used to burn herbs um, instead, of, like instead of burning incense, I would just put herbs in a piece of coal. I'm gonna show you that. I'm not feeling like burning stuff now. I been like really sensitive today and I don't want that extra smell and smoke and it's already dusty in here because I've been painting and like filling in some holes and, and um, sanding so it's been like I'm, I've cleaned and it's somehow still very dusty But so this is old. 
but it's like If you're not familiar with this, you just put this in a fire safe a plate or something. And then you put, uh, it's like a little valley in there, like a little hole area that you put whatever herbs you want to burn. So you just put it in, in there and then you um, light it, just the, like, the middle part, and then it's like, like, a little bit like fireworks, and then when you blow out the fire, and there's just smoke of the herbs that you're burning, but it is, like, there is, like, some other residue of the coal thing that goes into the smoke, and, like, Also, if you've had your herbs, if they've been like exposed to dust, then they've been sitting in a jar for a long time. I don't know, maybe it's like dust, but there's just, like seems to be always like some extra stuff that goes into it. So I kind of stopped doing it, but I might do it again, start doing it again and try it out like with some like fresh herbs that I actually have like in my kitchen. So this has been like just like kind of things that I've bought especially for this if that makes sense anyway bringing out my Japanese incense just for fun, but I'm not gonna light it. sticker here is like fuzz, uh, weird. like furry fur, like soft it's like softer than the like this is obviously like a paper like I whatever it's called in English and then this is like a sticker but it's it's like soft it's like softer than any other sticker any other Bridge sticker. <laughs>
I am like I would like if you were like awake now and like consciously listening and not like like if you're like are up to it then I would love to get suggestions for what to call like my videos like how to differentiate so that you know if I am like this like cozy chill but like very soft spoken but I'm still like talking but not really about anything I'm just like talking about what I'm like touching and like using for like sensory just like enjoyment and relaxation and I I am autistic and I like I can explain things but I will not stop <laughs> I just go on and explain things and, and say them in like 10 different ways even metaphors and all the details um, when I'm comfortable and like so I'm always I always have a hard time with titles I'm like how can I explain this so everybody understands kind of what they're getting themselves into I mainly um always like what I would like to differentiate between is the like these like I was saying like chill talking ASMR sensory stuff sounds visuals textures kind of like whispering soft-spoken not talking about anything serious okay and then the healing sessions that are no talking um i think that's maybe easiest just to say like no talking in the title and then there's like in between like a little bit talking here and there but we're still here to do some like healing we're working on this and like or not maybe it's like asmr sound sensory things but i'm still talking in between but not very much like in this one so and like for those of you who watch like most of my videos are like all of them were all kinds at least like i'd love your input because i know that some people and we all have our preferences we all have our opinions i enjoy doing like not always no talking not always talking i like to play with it and some and mostly follow what what i have energy for and what i am inspired to do because this is not like this is supposed to be play for me i know a lot of people only like to watch the specific type of videos and that's totally fine so that's why i want people to know what they're getting into when they click my video so that was like a two-hour talk about a question that could have been simpler so that's how it is to interact with me you're welcome So these incense are really like different from many other incenses because there's no like um they burn basically the whole stick is covered in the herbs. So it's all meant to burn. It's not just the like until you reach the point where it's just like stick. So I'm gonna show you.
so apparently it's really easy to make incense like this. Just have to have like ground herbs and herbs probably not like it can't be just any herbs they have to be like sticky in some way like I think that's why they use cinnamon a lot because it like maybe like is sticky a little bit maybe that's a lot of crap <laughs> that's like what I'm just what comes to mind but um yeah so I might make my own incense to use in my videos. Anyway. Okay, I'm checking up on my candle and it is not doing what it normally does but I actually I'm just gonna show you I actually also forgot um I was actually I, I was in a hurry when I was making this I just I was having like a like I very um strategically did not be did not be uh, what is the language um very thorough because i was like okay i will either spend like all my energy on these candles or like all these candles or i will like not do it until you know november or something or i can just do it really simply now for like 10 10 minutes or something and i decided do it simply and quick and not, you know, lose myself in it. And so I only put one wick, but um, it would be better if I had put two or three, but I mean, it's just going all over the place. I think that's not the only uh, problem because I made a smaller one and I lit it yesterday and this also happened, but on a smaller scale. If you are a candle expert, you can comment and let me know if you think it's because the wicks are like two or three years old. Um, because I used to make candles all the time and there was not a problem. Like this has never happened before, but I've never done it with old wicks before. Or I've never done it with lemon, uh, lemongrass oil. <laughs> I wouldn't think that was the problem, but anyway, it's burning. I mean, for like everybody for Christmas like two years ago yeah and these yeah This is citrine or wait, is it? No, what is the other name? Oh, a cal cal calcite? Orange calcite? Maybe. Yeah, and I some I somehow always lose my thumbnail first when I do. Uh, 
then I'm not a crystal expert, obviously. I okay, do not remember. So I'm just gonna put them in my hand and show you. We're getting another kitten in a few days. This is gonna be its like starting safe space, this room, so I can't leave anything small, tiny that they might chew on. But I want to show you this like in a better light. Okay. God, I got these in Palm Springs in downtown Palm Springs Crystal Fantasy I gave oh that makes sense because it yeah it just like it's like a freebie with something I bought there. Okay, uh, and uh, again, if there's a crystal expert, <laughs> can tell me what this is. Is this uh, some kind of a jade or it's like kind of pink and, and moss green or earthy? Big rug that we have um, in our bedroom now. 
but these are so these are so beautiful. There's like some writing on them, and there is some like stuff. But and it's like the paper is so. Okay, kilograms. But this is like this is not in um like a number number. It's in English it's written like N O but in Icelandic we, we do an R dot. So these are not Icelandic. Just interesting. Yeah, so I kind of are all of them just say the same thing. But yeah, treasure. Before I got them, I just, you know, always buy these. Like Christmas or my candles or whatever, whoever I want to give like a note to or something. It's just like from Tiger or something. with some rattle sounds. If you like this one, I have a video where I only do stuff like that. Through the entire video, so I will link that up.
you so much for watching. Let me know if um, if you like this kind of just like sensory play, chill uh, kind of video. And please like it and subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, let me know. Just say hi in the comments. And thank you so much for stopping by. Um, hope to see you next time. Or I mean, I won't see you, but I hope that you will watch my future videos. Anyway, until next time, bye.